Alright, so I'm sure a lot of you guys have already heard about this, but in case you missed it, let me quickly fill you in on this massive mess that Global is currently in. Alright, so uh, I guess we'll start with the most recent development, which is to do with the upcoming World Tournament, the 36th Global World Tournament. It was supposed to start in about two days from now, and honestly, I was pretty excited for it, man, because it's just something to do, it's new content to grind, which is, you know, something that Global has been missing for quite some time now. So I was definitely looking forward to it, I was excited to stream it for you guys, and now that's no longer going to be a thing, it's no longer happening because it's officially been postponed indefinitely. If you go into the news here and scroll down to the World Tournament section, you will see that it says postponed due to the issue with support items. Now if you guys don't know what that's referring to, um, you might remember yesterday we had this super extended maintenance, right? That was supposed to only last about four hours. It got extended by three hours, then another three hours. Then the game was opened for like an hour, and then we went into emergency maintenance, and that went on for another like five or six hours. So in total, this was like a, I don't know, 16 hour maintenance. And the thing that's ridiculous to me is that not only did this maintenance not really introduce anything too substantial, I mean, we did get the new update, which added a few visual things like the, you know, Dokkan Festival exclusive logo that pops up when you pull a Dokkan Fest unit, and also, you know, some separate pages for like the giant ape transformations and stuff like that, which is cool, but nothing, like I said, too substantial, right? So it didn't introduce anything crazy, and it actually gave us this game-breaking bug that would cause the game to crash every time you used a support item. And I think this applies to every stage, every, you know, mode, any support item, uh, as long as you popped like a Ghost Usher or a Senzu Bean or whatever, your game would literally crash and you would have to restart it. Now, of course, this does, you know, present a huge problem when it comes to the world tournament where if you're doing higher difficulties like 15, 20, 25, 30x, the enemies hit extremely hard, right? So you often have to use a support item to just survive. Like you need to use Ghost Ushers, you need to use uh, King Yemas or uh, healing items like Senzu Beans and uh, Android 8s and stuff like that. So the fact that we won't be able to use support items without crashing the game, without breaking the game, is, uh, you know, an issue. So I understand why they had to postpone it, but it also doesn't make sense to me that it's taking them this long to fix this problem. Okay, because like yesterday when it first happened, a lot of people were telling me about it. They were like, yo, are you going to make a video about this? Are you going to talk about this? And I just like didn't really want to make a big deal because in my mind, I was like, this is not that significant of a problem, right? Like I'm sure, I'm sure within the next 12 to 24 hours, they'll fix it. They'll like, you know, release a patch or something and just patch it out um, and we'll be fine. You know, we'll be able to go back to playing the game normally without having to worry about crashing it when we accidentally use a support item. And uh, also there were a bunch of like different events that were not available because of this issue too. And that never happened, right? So at this point in time, Global is literally broken. Okay, like JP is doing fine. They've got a huge update coming with like some game changing features. Whereas for Global, we also have a game changing feature, I guess, but not in a good way, you know, like it breaks the game in a bad way. So, um, yeah, I mean, it's kind of funny if you really think about it. It's also kind of sad, but that's where we're at, man. This is, this is global right now. And hopefully it gets fixed sooner than later. I mean, I still want this world tournament to happen. I kind of thought that like, you know, the world tournament would just proceed as normal because I had no idea it would take them this long to solve this issue. And of course, I don't know what the, you know, back end of things look like. I don't 
know how difficult it would be to patch something like this out, but if you guys are programmers out there, if you guys design games, feel free to let me know in the comments down below if this is like a very difficult thing, because apparently it is, you know, like I thought it was going to be simple, I thought it was going to be a couple of hours, you know, 12, 24 hours at most before it gets fixed, and right now if you go into, you know, the event section, like literally half the game is missing too, right? Like it's not just the world tournament being postponed. We don't have Super Battle Road. We don't have Extreme Super Battle Road. We don't have the Legendary Goku event. We don't have Infinite Dragon Ball history. Like literally all that's here right now are Dokkan events. And you know, those longer events like Infinite Dragon Ball history, uh, the LGE, stuff like that are a pretty substantial part of the game. And the fact that they're not here um, gives us even less things to do than normal. Like I know a lot of people before would run like Super Battle Road just for fun with different teams to test out their teams, you know, test out their new units because those are, you know, more challenging events than Dokkan events and it gives you a better sense of like how well your unit performs. And now, you know, us global players don't even have that option. So yeah, uh, this is where global is right now. Hopefully they fix it. As I said, sooner than later, um, in terms of compensation, I know a lot of you guys are asking about like what kind of compensation they should give us. Like, there's been some, you know, 300 stone memes coming up once again because this is a pretty significant problem, right? This is a pretty significant glitch or bug. Um, and what I would tell those people is don't get your hopes up. I wouldn't hold my breath for any kind of significant compensation, maybe like 5 to 10 stones or something like that, maybe even no stones, honestly, because they've done that in the past, you know, where like Global has had some kind of bug and when they fix it, they issue an apology, of course, but they don't give us any kind of compensation on top of that. So I wouldn't necessarily be surprised if that happened as well. At this point, man, all I want is my world tournament and for the game to work the way it's supposed to you know like <laughs> we joke about global shafts and stuff like that from time to time but uh this kind of seems like a global shaft i mean of course it's not intentional i don't think they intentionally broke the game but the fact that it's you know persisting for this long that this much time has passed without anything being done seems kind of shafty to me i don't know let me know your opinions in the comments down below, especially my global mains out there. Um, how do you guys feel about the situation? Do you feel like compensation is justified? How much compensation would make you happy? As I said, I'm not expecting anything. I'd be happy if we got like 5 stones or 10 stones or whatever, but just fix the damn game, Bandai. You know, like, give us our world tournament. I mean, we, we shouldn't have to postpone the tournament that's happening in like 2 days because they can't fix something like this in time. I mean, this is just silly. You do a 16 hour maintenance and break the game instead of making it substantially better. Like it just, yo, what's up with that? Um, anyways, that is today's video. That's really all I gotta say. Um, if there's any updates, I'll make sure to keep you guys updated. But for now, this is where we're at. Global is currently broken. We're missing a ton of, you know, big events. And uh, the next major event that was supposed to happen this weekend is no longer happening because the uh, bug has not been fixed yet. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.